Good morning, everybody. Welcome back from Salmon Scott Selections here for Monday, February 27th. For again, today's play of the day, a quick recap what happened yesterday. We had a loss in college basketball with Illinois, minus three and a half at minus 120 on points bet. We faded a team that had lost nine straight, but Ohio State woke up, kind of. It was mostly Illinois not being able to shoot. Uh, you look at you look at the numbers yourself, but Illinois could not have a shot the entire game, and they scored 60 points. And it's pretty difficult to win if you're going to shoot that badly from the floor. So either way, I picked up a loss for a winner here on Monday. And for today's play of the day, going to pivot to the NBA, look at a game between the Heat and the Sixers taking place at 7 p.m. Eastern time. And for this match, we're going to take a player prop in this one. We're going to take James Harden under 10 and a half assists at minus 132 on FanDuel. Time recording of 2.30 a.m. Eastern time. Covering is why we're going to take Harden under in assists. First reason, look at the two games since the All-Star break. Harden has definitely not done a great job at facilitating, and he's played a bunch of minutes, played 41 minutes against Boston, and played 40 minutes against Memphis, and yet he had less than nine assists in each of those two games. And you're looking at his historical numbers against Miami, and he's really not done well at racking up assists. He's had less than 11 assists in five of his last six regular season games against Miami, and I specified regular season games because I wanted to separate the playoff games from last year since they did have a six-game playoff series, which Miami won. However, in those six games, Harden played a lot of minutes, obviously because it was a playoff series, but he had a less than 10 assists in each of those six games. So whether it's the playoffs, the regular season, Harden's assist numbers have been pretty underwhelming against the Heat, and I think as a result, this number is a little bit too high. Plus, Miami this season has done pretty well at preventing assists as the Heat ranked 13th in the league in opponent assists per game. So it's not elite elite, but it's still above average. And I think that bodes well for the Heat's chances of limiting him to around eight or nine assists in this matchup. Plus, we know Harden does have the ability to have a decent amount of assists or go on some runs with some assists when Embiid's out of the game because the Sixers do play a bit faster with Embiid off the court. However, the Heat have done a great job this season of preventing fast break points as the Heat are allowing just 12.1 fast break points per game, which is the fourth fewest in the league. And as a result, you can expect to see a pretty low-scoring game in this matchup. It's why this total is around 216. Philly's team total is around 111 flat. And you're looking at the overall pace for these teams. They're both extremely slow. In the last 10 games, the Sixers have the second-slowest pace in the league. And the Heat have the fourth-slowest pace. So I expect to see this game being played primarily in the half court where possessions are at a bit of a premium. You see a lot of long and ugly possessions that drain the shot clock. And with the low total with money coming on the under, and with the overall just his history of Harden's assist struggles against Miami, 10.5 does seem a little bit high. There's also the chance the, the Heat get blown out again, like we saw against Milwaukee a couple of games ago, and maybe Harden gets benched if they're up by a lot of points. But I think that 10.5 is simply put too high. I could see Harden having a good game, but to have 11-plus assists against this Miami team is a bit much to ask for, and I think Harden probably finishes around 8 or 9 but 10 and a half, based on the historical numbers and based on the two games since the All-Star break, I think this number is too high, and I'll take the value with the unders. Play that once again here for Monday, February 27th. is going to be on Harden, under 10 and a half assists at minus 132 on FanDuel. Bye, everyone.